Right, and uh, Deputy President William Ruto now says uh, the Kenya Kwanzaa Coalition has no interest in reviving the Building Bridges Initiative. Responding to his critics who have accused him of plotting to bring back the BBI through the back door by creating the position of Chief Cabinet Secretary in the Kenya Kwanzaa Power Sharing Deal, Ruto said the coalition will not spend taxpayers' money on a referendum. Following the revelation of the details in the Kenya Kwanzaa Pact that would make ANC leader Musali Mudavadi the Chief Cabinet Secretary, critics of Deputy President William Ruto have accused him of attempting to sneak changes sought through the impugned Building Bridges Initiative despite opposing it. Friday, the Deputy President while leading the Kenya Kwanzaa troops in Kasarani constituency in Nairobi dismissed the allegations as baseless. Ruto says the coalition has no interest in reviving the constitutional changes debate saying the money is meant for the referendum would be used by his administration to create employment. Nini watu wakuzimia wachaneni na mpango yetu. Sisi hatuna biashara na BBI. Nini mulikuwa munataka kutumia bilioni hamsini atikubadilisha katiba. Sisi tutawaonyesha vile ya kupanga serekali bila ya kuwaribu pesa ya wananchi. Hatuna bilioni hamsini ya kupanga kazi ya viongozi. Iyo bilioni arbaini ndio tutapanga ajira ya hawa vijana. Ruto instead hit back at his opponents in Azimio, accusing them of preoccupying themselves with the Kenya Kwanzaa Pact, while their pact was still shrouded in secrecy. Na njini munasema mambo ya UDA, njini munasema mambo ya Kenya Kwanzaa, ati mkataba wa Kenya Kwanzaa mbele nyuma. Wapi mukataba yenu ya kuzimia? Mukataba yenu inaandikwa usiku. Inaandikwa wakati watu wamefungwa macho. Na sasa haiwezi kupatikana. Hata wale waliandika hiyo mkataba yenu hawana nakala, wanalalamika saa hizi. Mambo yetu na nyinyi ni tofauti kama usiku na mchana. Yetu ni ya wazi, yenu ni ya giza. Following Mama's Bear section of leaders from Mount Kenya region, led by former Kiambu Governor William Kabogo, uh, the pact had not solidified the position of a vote-rich region in Ruta's government. The deputy president assured his supporters that he would be keen to implement the one-man, one-vote, one-shilling principle. Kwa hivyo, wacheni maneno, tutawaonyesha vile Kenya inaweza kupangwa bila ya kuweka kuharibu pesa ya wananchi na mimi nataka ni wakikishie wa Kenya wote hata ile ya one man one shilling one vote tutaitekeleza bila ya kuharibu pesa kwa kubadilisha katiba Ruto says his track record sets him apart from his opponents calling on area residents to support his bid kura ya hasla hapa nione kura ya hasla John Jacob Curia Easy Friday.